Hey Cynical Militia, Professor Cynical back again with another glitch video. Now guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to get any cosmetic item from the Quicksilver Companion and keep it completely for free. That is right. Now I'm doing this video in response to a certain comment on the channel if you want to quickly read it. Now I did mention in my previous video how to do this exact glitch. But because Australians like this cannot follow simple instructions, I will make an entire video dedicated to this wonderful chap and prove him completely wrong. Alright, so let's get into today's video. Alright guys, so first of all, what we always need to do is be in the anomaly and jump in and out of our ship. That is going to create a save point. It makes it so then it's a completely clean slate in case anything messes up between now and and when we complete the glitch, we always have a clean slate to go back to. The next thing we're going to do is go over to the Quicksilver Companion. Now, as you can see in my Quicksilver, uh, this is an alt account. And I have 125,000 Quicksilver. Fantastic. Now, in this account, I don't have all of these armor sets unlocked. So, we're going to go ahead today. And we're going to go ahead and unlock every single one of them. Now, don't worry, guys. If you've only got enough to buy one. Do this glitch and then buy the next one and buy the next one because you'll get refunded back every time you do this glitch. Which in turn, guys, makes it free to do. So once you've gone ahead and you've bought whatever armor set you want to use, you're going to go over to the appearance modifier. Now, in the appearance modifier, guys, you need to have two save slots completely empty. And we're going to go ahead and put on that wonderful armor that we have just bought. So we're going to put on the armored chest piece, for example, and we're just going to put some accents on there and armored shoulder pads. Fantastic. Gloves as well. We can't forget the armored gloves. There we go. Oh, XO gloves are cold now. Fantastic. Oh, I always do the customized accents as well. Armored legs, sorted, and we're going to go on to armored boots as well. Fantastic. I think that's everything that I can use the now. Just quickly remember everything that I bought. Fantastic. Right. So the way that we need to do this now is, as you can see, the Amazon. So now, guys, what we need to do, the two empty save outfit slots. So for me, that's two and three. We're going to save on both of them. And then we need to override the save on both of them as well. So we're making a double save on both of them. Now, once that has been done... What we're going to do is get an item and we're going to transfer it over to a player. It can be any player that you want. It doesn't matter and it doesn't matter what item. Now, personally, I like to try and give good items away. That's my own preference. So, unfortunately, he couldn't hold all those wonderful chromatic metals. And I'm going to go ahead and give him some... Oh, no, maybe. Oh, that was the, uh, the first chap I tried to give it to. There we go. So, I've sent it over now to the other chap. That's been sent. Always make sure, guys, that whatever item you do send, it actually says the word sent. If it's not, you need to keep on trying. Now, in my case, it says sent, so we're going to reload our auto save. Now, guys, what's going to happen is you're going to be back in your game and you're going to be back in your old outfit. That's completely fine. But the first thing we're going to look at is, as you can see there, just very quickly, that my actual Quicksilver has been refunded. Fantastic. That's the first part of the glitch. So now what we need to do is go back over to the appearance modifier. Because remember, we have two save points in the appearance modifier that, if it's done correctly, should have all of our armor. So there we go. Appearance modifier. We're going to click on it. I'm going to click on outfit number two. So there you go. Fantastic. And just for further proof of the pudding here so this is my exo suit this is all the stuff that i've just paid for with quicksilver then got a refund back for so just to show you guys this is 100 percent legit and working and just to prove this even further guys we're going to go back to the quicksilver synthesis champion and then we're going to scroll down until we see those armor sets again and there we go we have the option again to purchase some oh would you look at that now, guys, I am not one for being a bad loser. However, I am very well known for being a bad winner. So I want to say to that lovely Australian chap in the comments section who posted that comment, Ha! In your face, bro! I told you. So there we go, guys. That's absolutely 100% working. Now, one last thing you need to do is you need to go back over to your ship. You need to jump in and out. That's going to create a save point. 
So every time now you reload your auto save, which is what we're doing right now, every time you reload your auto save, you'll now just keep the armor on. There's no need to keep going back to the appearance modifier. So this is a, a tweak after the fact on how to actually keep the actual appearance up without having to go to the appearance modifier every single time in order to put your gear back on that you've technically got for free. This way then it keeps it there for free. Fantastic. So guys, you can use that appearance modifier method and if you want to go ahead and use that appearance modifier for any other reason or purpose, you now only need one slot. You can delete the other ones, not a problem. But there we go, guys. So we're just going to do a very, very quick recap for anybody who is genuinely struggling with this. Step number one, guys, you need to go to the Quicksilver guy and get whatever armor set you want to buy. Remember, it's going to cost you first, but you will get fully rebated for anything that you do spend. Step number two, guys, go to the appearance modifier in the anomaly itself and go ahead and and put on all of your items that you've just bought at the Quicksilver guy. Make sure that you put everything on and don't miss anything. Step number three, guys, this is where the magic happens. Make sure you have two saved outfit slots available, and we're gonna go ahead and save on both of them. Then click on number slot two and three, in my case, individually, and overwrite the save again. This is in total four saves. Step number four is find a wonderful person to give over any item that you wish and then reload your raw or save. But you really do need to make sure that the item is 100% sent before you reload your raw or save, otherwise it will not work. Step number five, after you've reloaded your raw or save, go back to the appearance modifier and put back on your saved outfit. Step number five, go back to the Quicksilver Companion and make sure that you can buy those wonderful armor upgrade kits again. If you can buy the armor sets, fantastic. It means that you have done the glitch. And then guys, it's just a case of jump in and out of your ship, make a save point and reload your auto save. That way then your armor keeps on you every time then going forward. Also guys, as an optional extra step, laugh at all the Australians and the negative haters in the comment section because as you can see, this is fully working. Alright guys, well that's everything from me here today and as always my name is Professor Cynical and I'll catch you all again in the next one. Bye for now. Thank you every single one of you for watching today's video. Now do me a favour, smash that like button if you enjoyed it. If you are new around here, subscribe to the channel. I release videos like this all the time. If you're feeling extra generous today, you can go ahead and head over to my Patreon page. Link in the video description. Anything that gets contributed to the channel, guys, goes back into the channel. It's a massive help. So if you do decide to go down that route today, I want to say a massive thank you. Also, if you have some extra time today, don't forget, check out some more videos. I'll have some popped up here on the right-hand side for your viewing pleasure. Right, anyways, I'm off to go and hunt some Australians and eat some Crayola.